So are you guys excited for Avengers? Ant-Man is gonna expand inside. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's not. gonna end with Thor clapping him in the head. None of us have seen it yet. It's coming out tomorrow in South Africa. We're going to see it. Everyone's excited. Do you care or do you not have any theories about me. Avengers? Yeah. I'm not a people are gonna probably like kill me for this, but I'm not a big movie fan. Oh. Or Avengers Marvel and yeah, Star Wars. <laughs> Hashtag Star Batman is Sorry, Superman. all the Avengers. Dude, you just no, used that as an opportunity to, to take a dig at George Lucas. <laughs> I'm excited for Star Wars as well though. There's a lot of good movies coming out this year. And no time to see them at And no time to see them. Where's my talk? Yeah, just so that you guys know, if you're coming to study engineering, the male to female ratio is disgustingly high. It's mostly dudes out here. So like, be prepared. We're still rolling. Yeah. yeah. You're just rolling. It's not my It's got an uncomfortably long <laughs> Edit. Stage. Edit. What? He's a one take Film one drunk, one. edit sober. That's how. Film drunk, edit drunk. Be drunk. <laughs> Quote of the day, bitch. Quote of the day. Quote of the day. We just uh, finished our ER tut. There was uh, much running around and stress. We don't know what's going on. The problem finish the lecture and then two minutes later literally it's the next lesson we come down here and we try and write the touch on the stuff that we haven't learned properly yet so not the greatest it doesn't count for a lot of marks but still a lot of stress as you can see ryan how was it uh very frantic that's it yeah that's it and yeah off to maths now camps hello how's it good thanks it's half past four we here in the last lecture of the day pause everybody's looking just a <laughs> Good time. Good time. <laughs> yeah. um, it's been a long day, a very long day, but it's almost done. And then we're basically assignment. done for the week in terms of lectures. And yeah. Cause assignment all day, every day. Angie's here as well. At least Mitch is doing this. <laughs> He's trying. <laughs> hey Angie, say hi. hi. The whole crew is here. Making their way home or to the bus. Making my way downtown. Walking fast. I'm homebound. Hey, we can make it tonight. Baby, that's just fine. Don't know what I'm doing. Feel like I am going crazy. Keep it down. Back to res now. Lecture's done for the day. Just got to smash cars the whole day. Um, gonna work on the assignment the whole day. And if I get really tired on that and I need a break, I'll take a break at midday and I'll uh, code my cos prac instead. <sighs> Can't wait to be done with this subject so much. But my roommate Ruli, um, he's studying computer science and uh, well, let me tell you what he has to say about this cos module. Ruli's studying computer science and you say this cos212 is the hardest cos module you have this year. Yeah, yeah, definitely like the other ones, <laughs> they don't compare. <laughs> really? <laughs> okay, well, again, it's because of management. Like, how they manage this one compared to the other ones. The other ones seem like they're actually trying to make us pass. This one's mission. <laughs> 100%. I'm just busy struggling now with the assignment. Oh, yes. Yeah. Uh, I'm finishing in like three hours' time and battling. Rudy's also battling. Yeah. No, like, I can say this is the hardest assignment we've ever got. To. This <laughs> module. At the beginning of the module, she said, um, Prof, uh, what's her name? Uh, that. Prof Bosman yeah. said that this is the most important computer science course the Varsity offers because it's all about data structures and yeah. algorithms and tries and B-trees and stuff but what they didn't mention is that it's fucking difficult as well because of the assignments and cracks being structured in such a way that you can do hours and hours of work understanding your graphs and your um, B plus minus trees and B star trees and that but if you don't have one small thing working you're going to get a zero for your assignment but She did say look at your partners one of them are failing. <laughs> right, you're right. She said one out of two are failing. Exactly. So, ah, uh, cause. <laughs>
look good, you know it I can tell you're soaking up all of it now Hey, hey, listen to what I say, say Let's get to it and we won't tell nobody Yeah, we won't tell nobody I, uh, I'm finished with my Cospack. I ended up getting 9 out of 221. Fuck those guys. Um, <clears throat> but I only, I only attempted half of it in my delete method. Very convoluted, very difficult. Um, I was trying to figure out lots of it there. Didn't end up working. Um, <clears throat> I searched Cos212 on Google, and one of the first results was actually a petition from four years ago to change the way the module was structured so that people don't have this terrible failure rate after trying and putting so much work into it, but obviously nothing's changed since four years ago, so what can you do? Um, I'm going home now, going to watch Avengers, I'm so excited, and yeah, I'll see you at the train station, because I ain't walking with this camera out in the dark. There's occasional moments where you just, uh, you've got a break and a few minutes to think about stuff. <coughs> And I always come around to the thought that I am so grateful to be alive in the 21st century with the internet and communication and just oh, the amazing kind of communication we have with um, other human beings. I was just talking to my mom and dad, telling them I'm on the way home. And I was just uh, talking to a mayor from Chicago, my good friend who lives over there now. And I was just talking to Darren as well, who's back in Pretoria. And it's just, I love it so much being able to connect to the people that are important to my life at any time of the day. And just every now and again I think about it and I'm like, damn, what a great time to be alive. On the uh, bus, going to Fourways now. <coughs> Good way to spend a Friday night. But now it's really okay, I've been voice noting Darren and uh, it's as, just as I was saying, being in contact with people over the internet, with good friends and that, all day, every day, any time of day, it's very, very nice. That was literally the best movie I've ever watched. I won't give any spoilers away, but there were some incredible moments. They and, all die! And they all die! They do not all die. Some of them do, some of them don't. You know, who knows. It was amazing because there were moments of fan service where I, I literally shouted out in the movie theater in amazement because it was so cool and so epic. And then the way it ended was so clever and so smart, but also so sad, but also so happy and so justified. And um, Thanos was an awesome villain once again. And there were some other villains in the movie which were like, were like dark sides of people which were awesome. And there were good sides of people. And there were some funny moments and some excellent writing by the uh, directors. I don't know. I think Russo Brothers? Maybe? No? Oh, it was so incredible. It's my new favorite movie. I literally have to watch it again just to see some of the moments again and to understand what was going on because the, um, there was so much back and forth and the plot was very complicated so you had to understand. But it was literally my new favorite movie. That was amazing. Uh, I'm going to read all the reviews now that I can finally, without spoiling it, um, before I go to bed. But that was amazing. And uh, I'm going to end the vlog here on such a good note because that was amazing. And wow, it's been a long week. Thanks for watching.